All right, then welcome back to God of War after <laughs> two hours of wise. Guess I'm just going to be playing one hour of this. Hopefully, I don't forget too much. You know, I think I'm going to use the punches more often, seeing that pretty much what we do is kind of like a attack like that. Going boy, but boy, <laughs> give him a break. Come on, anyways. So welcome back to God of War. I think Wise is a game that requires more of my uh, vocal prowess. And God of War, well, I lay back more, just reacting to whatever happens. Oh, what? Well. This artist is just kinda just going at it. You know what helps me sometimes? <laughs> as ridiculous as it may sound. Sometimes, I mean, you see how I forget bonus and stuff like that, and I'm like, oh shit. What helps me, normally what helps is just going back on post production and see what I'm pressing and analyzing what I did and what I do and be like, oh yeah, I could be doing that, this and that. Now that's impressive. It's the seeing on, on a different perspective. I'm doing <laughs> backseat gaming with myself. However, sometimes it's just like when I'm trying to sleep or whatever, uh, I normally imagine myself playing the game, like pressing buttons, attack, this one for attack, this one for cover, and stuff like that. It's kind of silly, but it helps. Are you going back? Because I think there was something. I mean, first of all, that. But there was a chest with I. It's not the one I I went back for, but I guess it's good that we now we know. Do you want me to do it from top or? Normally, if I'm having like a lot of trouble doing something. I usually think it's probably something that we can do later, but seeing this game, that's usually not the case, so let's just keep going. Sometimes you need to see things in a different perspective. Alright, cool. Oh, cool. Man, I, I swear, I, I have been trying... I always <laughs> say this when playing this, but I have been practicing 3D modeling a bit. And it's like from this guy named the Blender Guru. Great tutorials, easy to follow. And since the guy has no music in the background, you can play your own. And you know I love me some some good <gasps> tunes. Well, I just I just set up the Hyrule Warriors soundtrack. Father. Like at really low volume. Alright. Read it. From darkness, keep safe the light. Didn't do a very good job, did they? And, and I mean, the tutorial has been great. However, it seems that they are focus. The focus of the tutorial is now going into uh, into rendering, and I'm interested in the render aspects of of modeling. But for the time being, I'm interested in <laughs> learning to model first. I mean, I know it's not easy. <laughs> Especially when you're beginning. However, I do believe that I have a pretty good base. Like, 
everything else in about graphic design, photography, character design, color theory, etc., etc. General practice. I think it's going to help me a lot. It's not going to like make me an instantly good at at 3D modeling, but it's certainly better than nothing, right? Anyway, so what I was trying to say is that the tutorial is now focusing on on render a lot. However, I, I kind of want to focus myself into just learning how to model. I can worry about uh, rendering stuff later. Because, I mean, of course, normally you can make the models, but any engine wor worries itself about rendering in real time. I mean, you put, you put the model in a real engine, Unity, Source, whatever, and the engine does the, the rendering itself in real time. I mean, of course, it's good to know that how to work with materials because not no not everything can be looking the same. Anyway, so I mean, of course, if I, if you put the stuff into if you put like metal, something that's supposed to be metal or something that's supposed to be flesh, and just let the the render engine use everything the default is not going to look as great as if you know what type of material you apply on it. But that's just the material, not the completely rendering aspect itself. What I'm trying to say is I'll get to it when I get to it. There, the light. They've covered it up with that stuff. How did they do that? Look. Another light up. What's he doing? Oh no! Dying. Why are they killing him? He didn't do anything. Do not assume. War boy. You are seeing the end of a war boy. You do not know what led to this moment. But he didn't even defend himself. That was his choice. He make ours. And that is to kill everyone inside. <laughs> I pretty much did that on accident. When I'm using a Atreus for it, it's just getting, giving me a window while I try to focus what, I, what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> ah, that's not the one I wanted to do. And I'm kinda stupid for doing it like that. Oh, they just kills blast. I mean, it's bad tech melody. <laughs> Come on, we all know it. Completely not naughty dog. <laughs> what now? I'm sorry, I'm a Light terrible Nintendo fanboy. <laughs> Look for a way inside. Uh, creator save don't assume boy, and I think that's that's a good, good thing to practice. Not assume. What I'm trying to say is that I hate when people assume stuff when you're not even saying anything. I mean, to put an example, you hear that when I just said that. Oh, I don't want to focus myself on render now. And then I, of course, I began saying that I know that it's important to 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 know about materials too. That is a good thing. And I say that because what would happen normally? Oh my God, I'm being stupid. See, we easy. <laughs> So, I mean, let's say if I was with a, with a person talking and I said that, like, oh, I don't want to fuck on myself around it. Normally what usually happens is that someone just jumps the gun and, and thinks that just because you said that, you don't think it's important. Alright, I think I'm getting better. Not much, <laughs> but a bit better in the least. I seen at least I'm using my, my other abilities as much as I can. Anyway, so back with to what I was saying, like, you see how then I have to say, yeah, but, but I also know that rendering is important. Because I had when during a conversation and you said, you said like, like what I just said, like, oh, I don't want to focus on render now. And someone just immediately jumps the gun and says that, well, but, but the render is important too, man. Like, like, just because you don't say it, say that you t they take it as granted that you completely don't think it's important, like, come on! Like, I hate that, and, I, and, it, and it happens so often. 
Like, just because you didn't sell anything doesn't mean you either agree or don't agree with it. I hate it. You're like, I know, I know. <laughs> you just jump in the gun. Whatever, man. That's just me. Well, let's check this out first. Check this out. That looks too hard. Maybe we can find the light somewhere else. No, give me a moment. <laughs> I got this boy. Yeah, but it looks kind of complicated, actually. Yeah, if I were to do... I mean, I don't, I don't expect me to do that because that's kind of an ability. That's an optional, optional ability. See, it's too hard. We should go. Not yet. Right, we removed one, so that's progress. <laughs> I mean, where else, boy? Oh, of course, I, I guess it just start making more sense the more you start removing. <laughs> I mean, where else? Whoa! <laughs> that's supposed to go. You see the face? Just Bayonetta, all of a sudden. Whoa! I cannot see my timer, boy. I know I set it up, but I don't think we're supposed to be in here. Quiet. Where are we? Uh, Cortana from Halo 3? Not like Did inside here, but the mission. Stay alert and by my side. Whatever. Hey, when we make it to the light, how do you think we get it into the Bifrost? The witch said to step into it. She did? When she was ripped away from this realm. Oh, how did I miss that? You were more concerned with her safety than our goal. Father! Yeah, don't worry. Quiet! I have him. Your knife boy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. That is to kill them now, huh? Fuck you. Oh, it's probably just a knife then. I'm going to think of that. That was close. Do not stray from me, boy. You don't gotta tell me. <laughs> no, I got you. Kill this Warframe asshole. <laughs> oh, so sticky. Is the floor going to break? Gina, Luna! Another one! Stay back. Yep. Oh, we shot it again. The light. Yes, we are near our goal, but we must be careful. Understand? God. <laughs> Where are we resting in for? I thought I finished that. I mean, I did. I have just to upload everything. There. When it falls, be ready. We will need to move quickly. Okay. I mean, I have been second thoughts on Resident Evil 4. I mean, not if I should finish it or not, but I'm thinking that maybe rather than put the full playthrough, just put the whatever most important moments of it. So. Here they come! Stay behind me and protect our flight! So we can finish it faster. Ah, you surprised a lot of them. Well, let's see where it goes. Oh, they're kind of weak. Why? Keep shooting, boy. I will clear our path. <laughs> He's spamming the square and the freaking thing. Broken the tie between your bodies. There are many targets. You will not. <laughs> A narrow path negates superior numbers. Stay focused. Right, like pretty luckily just providing war tactics. There's a lot of them, really. They are weak. <laughs> I can't imagine myself fighting them in the same in the same light as every other enemy. The 
Defensa a fuerte, come on. Back. Are you injured? I'm fine. Wow, it's beautiful. The light, it's making the whole temple reappear. It's the source of all of it. Oh, nice. Wait, it's, it's singing. I hear. I hear her! I told you I heard her! Do you think she's in there? Is her in like, your memory? Ah. Ah. Or something else? Uh, that really hurt. I felt like my hand was on fire. I must say props to the, to the actor of Atreus. Stay here. Stay go. here. What? Only use it as a last resort. <laughs> the axe? Can you swing it, boy? You're giving me your axe? I'm letting you hold my axe. It is not a gift. <laughs> it's a curse. Still. It's better than nothing. Uh. Filter. I'm going to walk all dramatically. Come back. You left me here alone. Atreus? Alone with him. He always leaves. He's never here. He doesn't want me, and he never will. I'm sorry, you're taking the scenography in. <laughs> this looked like a battle arena. Well, it was then, but... What is it, Dark Souls? He doesn't know me. Doesn't seem to want to. I'm strong. I'm smart. I'm not what he thinks I am. I know better. He doesn't talk to me. Doesn't teach me. It should have been him. Do you hear me? Him, not you. Except... I don't mean that. You know I love him. I just wish he was better. I know he can be. So if he tries, I'll try. But if he doesn't, please come back. I know you're out there somewhere. Why did you do that? I saved you! You are trapped in there! I waited and I waited, but you wouldn't come out! So I pulled you out! Boy! I was gone only... 
how long. Moments. No! You've been gone a long, <coughs> long time. I didn't know what to do. You left me here again. <coughs> Why don't you care? I... That's impossible. We should go before they come back. I hope you got what you needed. I didn't. Or maybe I did. Yes. Look! There's our exit. But there's no light to make a bridge. We're trapped. And the witch's bowstring is useless. Boy, your bow. Hold it out. The whole core light arrows. What? Say <laughs> like this, please hold up. <laughs> Should do like cross the vision with Alphine light. Okay. Cool. <sighs> On my mark, loose your arrow into the stone. Oh, nice. We can now make our way back. Come. I think I was gonna pick himself too too fast after that scene. He was like, "Oh, look, we can go through here, but there's no light." <laughs> I was like, oh, "Okay, man, hope for how long we were actually out." I mean, <laughs> I think I just killed a lot of of things of these flying things. <laughs> wow, <laughs> boy. <laughs> I was going to say, which I'm sure I'm going to be interrupted, that that apparently, oh, maybe I can pick this up and throw it somewhere. Not fear as much. That that was like, of course, a joke, a meme, if you will say. I didn't really stretch and I just began doing things. I'm sorry. I was saying that. I was saying that there was this article saying God of War is finally like more deep than ever before. As in story wise, and someone was like, but God of War was always deep in story. And I'm like, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> I mean, I think God of War. I, I have always seen like this. I think I have always seen God of War. Like some sort of uh, the male fantasy, muscular guy destroys everyone, and he gets all the bitches. <laughs> For sure, it's a word, but I guess you get what I'm trying to convey, right? However, I'm thinking, you know what? I may be wrong about it. Oh, uh, uh, whatever, I guess. Because I was thinking, uh, they probably use like exactly what I think they are. But then I remember, well, I remember I used to have a terrible opinion about the GTA series until I played them. Oh, cool! But I guess I have to equip them somewhere, right? So let's do that. Anyway, so yeah, I had a terrible opinion on the GTA series because I remember in middle school. Every, every, every edgy, edgy team with <laughs> was following the male fantasy of oh yeah you do, you can kill a lot of people you can you can have sex with hookers and then kill them and get your money back and I'm like uh, I mean I'm surprised I don't think I'm like I myself am a godsend but but I was thinking man that's so. That's so immature, I mean, it's just what, what, what kids want, like, yeah, it's violent, yeah, I'm a new geek, I'm a new geek kid. I can't believe I actually think that <laughs> back then. I guess it is surprisingly, surprisingly mature. Not like, whoa, so mature, but considering. <laughs> whoa, easy there. Anyways, 
So, yeah, I was thinking, man, the GTA series seems to be just a pretty superficial one with really no depth into it. it. It felt really superficial. That is until I actually managed to play uh, Red Dead Redemption. And I'm like, oh, well, this game is actually pretty well written. Finally! I'll light the crystal if you find me an angle. <sighs> Let us make our way back up. So I'm like, oh, well, other games are open world. I guess GTA 4. Well, let's give it a try. And then I play GTA 4 and I see how much depth the, the, the game story has. And I'm like, oh, okay, maybe I misjudged this series. Then I jump to Saints Row. Then when GTA 5 was coming out, and I'm like, oh, okay, cool, let's play it out. And I actually like GTA 5. I mean, it's not, it's not like... It's kind of like silly in comparison to 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 GTA 4. I mean, GTA 4 was more greedy. I mean, that doesn't mean it's better, but it's certainly it's difficult to make to make a more greedy game. I'm gonna use Kelvin. Right? It's certainly more the bodies are just blocking me. It's certainly more difficult to make a, a great story that is taken serious than it is, but it's a right a more funny one. But even then, GTA 5 is is not it's not short by any means. It's like it's pretty good. It's pretty it's pretty cool. Uh, we're actually having the same <laughs> the same issue as in Wise Origins. Like I'm not upgrading anything. I'm going pre vanilla, and that makes things difficult. What's I saying? Well, I think just to finish the talk. And then I began to notice that, of course, GTA has a more uh, in-depth, how do I say, a more a more rich story than what you're led to believe. So I mean, I guess in that the GTA that this that this <laughs> that the kids in freaking in a middle school have. I mean, which was, I think, either San Andreas or Vice City. It, it's certainly... I don't believe those games are more of a story than what I'm led to believe. I mean, again, I'm getting overwhelmed with these game's mechanics, but... Really? I think, in fact, what we actually want to do is just remove the hiding. Where's even our trails? I think I, I was supposed to pick the boy up. Come on, son. <laughs> Get over here, man. Anyways, so yeah. I mean, so, bottom line, I think probably the previous God of War also had like a more rich story than we're led to believe. Sweet beans. Oh, I guess we can actually use this over there now. I don't know, boy. Oh, maybe we can go with the dude. With the dude and the thing. And we can actually upgrade our stuff. Whatever we can. Boy. I think I confused the run. <laughs> 40 minutes in. Uh, next big cutscene I see, I'm going to cut it out because it's already going to be 2 in the morning. <laughs> and you know your voice. <laughs> the... The later... Or who did I say? Well, the later it gets, the worse I start talking and we don't want that. It's not good for a playthrough. It just... It just like hurts the health. Oh, the channel. I just might. <laughs> so you saw me freaking moving the giant bridge thing I'm over. I think this is the least of our worries. I mean, it's probably just treasure, but whatever, man. If I can get it, I get it. And there's actually a good player, so I'm going to need all the help I can get. Oh, that's one of those. I 
think I saw one on the left. That was the other one. Maybe instead of looting a sacred temple, we could just get out of here. If I want your opinion, boy, I will ask for it. <laughs> Thanks, Kratos. Chill, boy. This is important. And you know it. Oh, my aim! Oh, my aim! <laughs> But this is just practice, man. This is just practice. Let's remember that. Because it's also good to know the optimal way to do this thing. Ah! And I miss again. You know, I think... I think the PlayStation seriously need to use more of the motion controls for aiming or even the freaking d-pad thing was that good enough for you? it wasn't what do I mean by the d-pad thing? Uh, no, the touchpad thing, I mean using it for aiming would be nice ah, uh, whatever, what do I know, right? I don't work for PlayStation they don't need my juicy ideas I'm just going to do it continuously until it, it eventually happens rather than think too much about it You know why I'm so stupid? <laughs> Just running around like a moron. Of course I will do that, right? Maybe I'm not so dumb. Well, I mean, clearly I can hear it from there, so maybe I just need to position myself. Probably here. Ah, idiot. Running around like <laughs> a stupid idiot. I guess it's just a matter of perspective. I kinda I kinda not like in the oof meme. I mean I think it's funny. However, I'm saying that the people who normally use it are just assholes. <laughs> There's no other way to put it. I guess I have said it before, but I don't mind losing online you can games. Reach the bowl now. Uh -huh. <laughs> Do you need a boost or something? Probably can it. You're like Bioshock oh Boy, what? Forget it. Go ahead. Greatest man or tallest tree begins as any more than me. Yeah, it's see, stupid rails. <laughs> I wouldn't have known. So, it's a door after all. Well, I mean, it's certainly not anything else. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> We're open for business. <laughs> you have a question. I hesitate to ask. That guy is flickering with the rose. Uh, whatever, minor details. <sighs> Feels like home, doesn't now. Great. The one with the horns is back. <laughs> what does he want now? He will be back. I mean, they look like peaceful creatures. You really gotta go back down here again? Do you see any other way? No. Then. And we go back down. Can I really move my camera? What, can, what do you want me to see, game? It's kinda, kinda dark here. Uh, I'm not really a fan of it. Is it just me or we haven't really encountered a, a normal loading screen through areas? I mean, of course, there's there's like when we die and we have to reset the the area puzzle, whatever. But I think it's going area to area because uh, I guess that's certainly impressive. Oh, 
Oh, it's meant to get really dark. Great. Now I can barely see. There is light. Make do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you could jump scare. You piece of shit, do you remember how much trouble you gave me? No, I'm going to beat the shit out of you, that's what I'm going to do. You little shit. <laughs> You're going to need a good visit to the dentist after that one. Bitch. <laughs> Shit. I'll need to see your chiropractor now, asshole. <laughs> ah, this is looking like a puzzle. But I don't think we can do it anyways. I think we need a stone. I don't remember you always use the abilities. Because otherwise I'm just putting myself at a disadvantage on purpose. Ah, about that. Even though I don't really use my PlayStation 4, I really don't regret the purchase. I really like Uncharted, this one, uh, the JoJo game, even though I think I will give the JoJo game a 7 out of 10, <laughs> and only because I like JoJo itself, otherwise the game is gonna have bare bones. Oh boy! I don't like the look of this! <sighs> what? What do I want me to do? I mean, there's a lot of them! My dumb face is overwhelmed. I guess there's only so many attempts. Well, I see four. And I see four. Maybe we just need to put each one in the same order that they are over there. That's the Bluetooth one. That's the R one. I'm looking for the F looking one. I guess there's multiple on each wall, you so you don't have to be changing place. Do they change like solo? Without me having any inputs? Okay. So I guess it's just a matter of finding, finding them. Okay, I, I think this one only has a Bluetooth one. That was another, the Bluetooth one. Ah, well, we we're for treasure. So, for this, the best treasure ever made. It is something. Come on, chest armor. Well, I mean, let's just check. Worst case scenario is just not better. I was thinking if we hit the next big cutscene, I'm going to quit it, but I think <laughs> we're not going to hit that big next cutscene anytime sooner, so I'm just going to continue for a little while. If it happens good, if not, well, I'm going to cut it. Because again, it's kind of late. And I also need to take care of myself. I, but I wonder what can I do. I guess I never finished the Blender talk. So I wonder what can I do. Because I mean, rendering, I think it's important, but it's not what I want to focus right now. I want to practice modeling itself. So I wonder what else could I be looking for. I mean, it's good to practice on your own. Boy, shoot. I know how it works. I said shoot! Shoot! It's gonna work. Good enough to RP. <laughs> I didn't pick the yellow thing, go. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Anyways. So yeah, I wonder what can I do to practice more. I guess it's good to be practiced on your own time. And if you encounter problem. Finally! We can use the same sand bowl that brought us down the first time. I want to get out of here. Let's hit that big next cutscene so we can quit it. <laughs> this is the next big cutscene. It's a boss. Ah. Oh. Oh. I need to shield myself. I need to remember that. Oh, 
I wonder if the red ones are just ones that I can simply not not dodge. They need to look for hell now. Oh, that was a pretty good chunk. Oh, I need to hold it. I'll oh, probably... Well, I don't know. <laughs> you piece of shit, you just die, man! I hope I can kick you in the face. What? What did it say? That we made a grave mistake. Use empty words from a date me in. Oh wow, the spectral wolf. What? Running someone. What? Oh, you want me to check it out? I have a quite running someone, so give it to tell more. Okay. Oh, nice. That's pretty useful. Equip it. You helped the wrong side? I... Let me guess. You're gonna be smug and say you told me we shouldn't get involved. That is enough. Can we go now? Why should we go in the wrong? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. But it's true, we shouldn't get involved. <laughs> Not Do a problem. You remember the answer? Yeah, yeah. Boy, read this. Boy, what's that? <laughs> you know. The only time you want to talk to me is when you need to. Do you want to tell me something? I said, the only time you care to talk to me is when you need me to translate for you. If mom was if here... If your mother was still alive, we would not be here at all. Yeah, going on top of the mountain to drop some ashes. Forget it. Fine. Couldn't you have been generic romantic and just drop it on the beach or something? No? <laughs> okay. I think I said bitch rather than bitch. <laughs> Same meaning. <laughs> was that the big cutscene I was expecting? I don't know. I mean, we seem to be so? back. Was she in the light? Who? You know. Oh, she was not there. That was pretty casual. Not like you would even care if she was. Boy, mind your tongue, boy. Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. All right. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? You do not know my ways. I know it has not been easy. <laughs> you just blink a little man, damn! In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you. That's good to know. Really? So, should we go back to Midgard? Face the black breath? Or do you think there's more to see in this realm? I think we've seen enough. <laughs> Hopefully, like creatures are not going to be a problem for us in the future. A <laughs> game? Said, is. Mother was a warrior. I don't know, really. Was she in a war too? Of a sort. Her family was decimated by hostile rivals, and she alone survived. She walked the warrior's path. But her war was to live on, to brave an unforgiving world alone. And that's why she has Sindri and Brock to make her the axe? She had the strength to wield such a weapon. You're back. I see you've been busy. How observant. I am known for my attention to detail. I wanted to hear what, what, what they were talking about. Oh well. Uh. 
Uh, let me tell you here. I was thinking of maybe upgrade, but I think I will waste time do doing that. Then I will end up, you know, uh, wasting time just in the outro. Doing that. Well, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> so I'll see you when I see everyone. Take care. And remember, shit, I don't know. Parents are kind of complex creatures. <laughs> You just think them as as their role rather than they are just persons playing that role. Anyways, see you. <laughs>